Yo guys, welcome back to Brandon's channel. Today we are back again with our number one global push here. A little progress update. Um, I don't know why I left on the video yesterday, but I think it was some somewhere similar to around this. But yeah, I've been streaming and stuff. I've been playing, and I've kind of been hard stuck. I think the highest I got to was like twelve point one or something. It won't, it won't show my profile, but yeah, that's kind of what I got around to here. But as you see, we are you know we're a solid. What is that? Less than two hundred elo away from getting into that top ten, which is hopefully something we can do in this video. So let's get straight into it. So here we are to the first game. As I said, I've been kind of hard stuck here. So I'm looking to hopefully get a couple wins on our books here. Because, yeah, right now I'm just winning like 30, 40 elo per game. And then I lose 150, which is not very fun here. So hopefully we can change the script right now. We are going to be banning um, probably Gale. I think we ban Gale. I think that will be pretty solid to ban here. Um, they ban Gale and Mo as well. So double Gale and Mo banned. Rico and Larry banned. Um, pretty, I mean, I don't know why Rico's banned to be honest. But that's pretty good bans here. Okay, we get a Jesse first pick, which is interesting. Something you don't see very often. But if they go Bali, maybe we get a good Mortis game. That's what we're hoping for here. But yeah, Jesse has a first pick. It's not very normal. I'd first pick probably Chester here. As you guys know, I really do like my Chester. I think it's pretty solid, very versatile. And there you go. There's the Bali here. Um, so we have two options right now. We can go Stu. We can go Mortis. Maybe something else opens up here, but we just got to really be careful of getting spawn trapped. I think bullets like Stu and Mortis are like good bullets to try and break out of that and prevent that. So that's why I'm thinking towards one of those two options here. Okay, this guy's already on the Mortis wavelength here. Um, if he goes Mortis here, I'm probably just to provide some sort of support. So maybe Bell or I don't know, maybe even like a Byron can be pretty good. Okay, well, he goes Mortis. We need something with a bit of damage or range. Hmm. Hmm, is Bell the option here? Hmm, I guess Chester could work as well if we get some wall breaks and stuff. Yeah, let's just do Chester. Like, I do like Chester quite a lot here. We... Okay, this is a pretty good game here. Um, do I go the power-up one? I'm gonna go the power-up one. Maybe it helps us out quite a lot here. But yeah, this is a very good Mortis game. Obviously, into uh, Meg, it's not ideal. But, you know, against Barley and BB, where it's very hard to hit him consistently and for a lot of damage, it's really good. And this Jesse game is not looking too bad here. So if we just play properly, we should be able to pick up, hopefully, some nice elo here. We'll see, though. Um, I don't notice anyone here. Yeah, I don't really know who they are. But, you know, they can still be us because that's just what's been happening here. All right, Mortis is going mid. And to kill, hopefully, the Bali. Okay, there we go. He's going in. Nice kill from him. Okay, pretty good start, I'd say so. Oh, Jesse's not moving. That's not good. Okay, let's just do this. Alright, I'm going to pop this here. Because I don't really want to uh, use all this here. I don't want to use my um, two plug against any of them. So, yeah, I'm going to just pop in and hopefully get a good one next time around. Okay, let's whack here a little bit. There we go, he's out of mech. Get heal, which is kind of perfect. We get more heals as well. So, we can just walk up straight away and help with the DB. There we go, nice. Okay, Bali's gonna go and become one shot. Let's just try and survive this here. Okay, well we get them quite weak here. Moist doing pretty well. The game is pretty even. We should kill this Bali. Bali has hypercharge. Jesse, what are you doing? Like what are you actually doing? Okay, there we go. Moist is going crazy. Well speed boost here. And there we go. Alright, this is where the spawn trap begins. I'm gonna take this left lane because I have more range. Bali hypercharge, so gotta try and prevent that. Oh, he doesn't use the hypercharge, interesting. Let's just pop the bomb there. There we go. Nice usage of that. We got damage boost as well. So hopefully we can kill him. There we go. He goes down. Okay, this is perfect. This is really good. We're going to try and kill that guy. Let's pop this. He's going to go down as well. And if we just play our cards right. This should be game here. Okay. Nice. There we go. He goes down here. We put a bomb here. And there we go, guys. We pick up the win here. Like I said, it's a very good Mortis game. He took the opportunity to go very aggressive, and that's what you just that's what you just gotta do with Mortis. You just gotta go up and get loads of pressure for your teammates, and it does pay off most of the time here. So again, same thing. Gonna go on the right side. And hopefully this Jesse plays a little bit better. I feel like he could have do he could have done like a lot more with his turrets. And he got hypercharged very early on, but he didn't use it properly. Okay. Oh, we got heal here. Sometimes you just get unlucky with the power-ups here. But this guy's going crazy. I'm gonna go down now. Let's just get the kill here. There we go. All right, perfect. We got this super here. Just pop it because we don't need it for anything else, really. 
Okay, some nice shots. Pop another one. There we go. Get a damage buff. Okay. Ooh, if we hit that shot, that would have been really good damage. Alright, we kind of messed up that. Mois is going crazy though. He's still alive. He's still alive. And he goes down. Okay. Well, we got a super in one. Hopefully, it's a really good one. If not, it, we are cooked. Okay, well, I tried to juke that. I think quite worked my way. What do we have? Okay, we have this. Mm. Moist gonna pop his hypercharge, I'm guessing. Nope, decides to save it for Christmas. Okay. Alright, we got the bomb. Perfect. Just do that. There we go. Um, both one shot here. Um, it would be very nice if this guy had his bats, but he doesn't. And he doesn't have gadgets, which is not good. Okay, let's pop this. We get a heal, which is not what I wanted. Nice on the Moyes. We got another heal here. Let's just pop it, because why not? Bang, there you go. Okay, he's dead. Just be careful of feeding this Barley now, because he is probably getting very close to his hypercharge, and that's where problems begin. Okay, here we go. Alright, we got stun here. Let's stun him there, there we go. Alright, he's gonna be one shot right now. Let's pop this as well, it's gonna be a damage boost. Mm, we go down as well. Alright, this is looking good. They probably win this game here. I really think the Moist would have just used his hypercharge when he had the chance to, and he would have been a lot easier for us. But yeah, looks like we're losing game number two. And that's how most of these games go. Most of these games are just back and forth. You know, they're never really 2 0, so they're always just 1 1. Do the like stupid things and stuff. But yeah, this game's really close here. Um, I don't know what we can do better here, really. Don't know what we can do better. For the win. But let's yeah. try, I guess. Mm. There we go. That's a good start. Let's try and get this kill into the Meg. Okay. Let's let him get that. There we go. All right. That's a really good start here. Hopefully, we can get a stun onto the BB. That'll be ideal. Okay. Let's just kill him instead. Nice bats. Okay. Let's just get pinched onto him. Alright, let's try and save the turret. Okay, we couldn't save the turret here, but let's just get our hits. There we go. Alright, this is what you call a pretty good gameplay here. We get a nice little damage buff. Okay. Um, there we go. Alright. Have heals again. Mortis going in with a hypercharge. Okay, nice. He gets a kill there, probably. He does. We get reload. Okay, we've managed to get BB to half HP. Mortis overcommitting a little bit, but look at that, guys. We have got so much control because of how aggro we've gone. And, you know, we just focus a lot more on staying alive, which is kind of what you need to do most of the time. The more you focus on staying alive here, the better the game always turns out to be. Okay, where's this Moist now? I mean, where's the Bali? Alright, Bali's just staying in the corner. Let's just wait here. Pop this. Got more heals. Perfect. Alright, nice. And just this guy last left alive. He's going to go down for hypercharge. And there we go, guys. That's going to be a very clean game number three. Picking up our first win of the video. And, um, yeah, there we go. We did a lot of damage here, um, surprisingly. But, yeah, Moist went crazy with the kills. Very nice. Plus 27, not too bad. Hopefully, we get some more into next games. So let's get straight into it. All right, here we are into the next game here. We have Dueling Beetles. Their first pick. So we're going to be banning Mo because, yeah, I think Mo's very good at controlling here. Reminds me a lot about Spike, but, you know, it's not similar in a way. But the shot pattern just reminds me a lot like Spike and how it's just so good at controlling and guaranteed hitting a shot every time here. Okay, we've got Surge Ban as well. Um, again, two double bans. Not very common here in the ban hank, which I don't know why. Maybe we're playing against Ben because that would make a lot of sense. But no, the middle guy banned uh, hank there. Okay, so we have Chester open. This is pretty good. Um, again, we have Throwers as well. Mortis, which can pretty much play into anything in this race. There you go, Lily. Okay, that's an interesting start, I guess. Um... Right now against this, I might just go like Stu Chester. I think Stu Chester is going to be a pretty good matchup. Clancy also works because, yeah, Lily needs to be careful in who he goes aggro on. Because if he goes aggro against Clancy, then three levels. Once you get crowd level three, it's the best brawl in the game probably. So don't, don't want to really do that. Okay, I like this approach. We have a wall break approach. Playing into the tank here. The only thing is they're going to go B maybe. Nope, they go, they go Sprout, which is interesting. Okay, we have a chance of going Mortis now. Um, yeah, Moist would be pretty good into this, I would say. Uh, we also have Stu as well, if you want to play off the wall break. Just break up the map even more. Uh, let's see the last pick. I'm Ooh, Jesse. Okay. Hmm. Right. What do we go here? 
We can go stew. Stew wall break can be pretty good into this. Um, like, like maybe in stew long dash works. We can go barley. Barley's pretty good. I suggested Doug. Really, Doug is not what we need. Okay, let's go stew here. Because I do think stew is going to be pretty good. I would go moist, but I want to try something else here. Go this, and then go that. That is the play here against this. That is what you go. And then, yeah, that is the right build here. Okay, so hopefully we're able to break up the map in time. And then once the map is broken up here, I don't know what this Lily and Sprout can really do. Jesse can have a good game if he gets an early turret, but yeah. It's not looking very good for them in the draft here. Let's see, though. Um, all right. I probably go mid. Okay. Everything is fine. I'm gonna break this. I'm gonna try and get an early hit here. There we go. We get our super early on here. I would have dashed, but there's no point. I'm gonna try and save my dash for like a good moment. Okay, he's gonna go invis here. Let's try and push up now. There we go. Okay, he's gonna waste his turret here pretty early on. Let's get the turret down. Okay, nice. Okay, we get our super back, which is pretty good. Not the best start because we're not getting much zone time here, but hopefully that changes. Yeah, we're gonna go break this, I think. Okay. Nice, we're able to juice everything. Jesse already has hypercharge, but that turret got completely melted. Mm, I kind of walked into that shot there, which is not very good. Okay, there we go. He has level 2 here, which is very good. I'm dead here. Alright. We've gotten back into the game though. He's getting his levels, which is nice. Does he get his hits? I think he does. Nice. Okay. Good value from him. All right. Let's try and survive now. Okay. They've already popped two of the hyperchargers, which is good. Which means hopefully we can get back into the game very soon. Okay. I don't want to feed too much. There we go. Nice kill. Okay. There we go. Another nice kill here. Let's just go back now. Okay, let's just wait for this Lily to pop super. I know he's going to be looking forward to me. I don't think he wants to push our Clancy here. There we go. Oh, he somehow got the crab. Okay. Well, nice kill from him. Okay. I just to stay alive here. Before we go down, we do. Okay, very, very close game. We need to focus the turret right now. And then I'll probably be able to break up this wall here. Okay, let's just focus on breaking the wall. Okay. Hmm. Okay, kill him. Kill him. We're killing him in time? No, we're not. Alright, well. Not the best start. Not the best start here. What can we do better? Hmm. I think I'm going to try and play more aggro this time. I think I wasted quite a lot here. So let's try and switch it up and play a little bit more aggro. But I'm very confused on how Jesse got hypercharged really quickly. Even though the turret was useless, it still shows that... We are taking quite a lot of damage here. So let's try and switch things up here. And uh, I'm going to go lane straight away. Just try and stall this Jesse out a little bit. Here we go. Okay, he's going to go down. Nice. Okay. Good little kill here. No one's behind us. Jesse wasting his ammo on me. Okay. Okay. So he's going to go here. Let's take him out quickly. Okay. There we go. He goes down here. Let's take Sprout. Okay, let's just try and flash our super to bait him out a little bit. He goes down. Okay, this is way better here. Because we are playing more just aggro. Exactly what we wanted. So he's gonna be there. He goes down. Perfect. Okay, now this is a pretty smooth game. Okay. Mm, we go down here. But yeah, look at that. We have a 50% lead. This is a night and day difference from last game here. So whatever we're doing is working, I guess. Let's just try and push up it. Okay, Lily Super's gone. Okay, I'm gonna get a Super back here. We can push up. Ooh, we go down here. Matt's staying alive, which is pretty nice. The Griff is doing a really good job here. We just need a couple more percentage. So we can just uh, kill the game. So let's just do this. Okay, let's just do that. Well, Sprout placed the wall here, which is pretty nice. Let's push into him. Let's draw him out. And there we go. We can just dash in. Oh, we can just walk in as well. And there we go. That's got a good little comeback there. Nice little adjustment from game number one. 
you know, instead of me going mid and, uh, yeah, instead of me going mid, we go lane, play a little bit more um, aggressive here, just try and distract them, keep the Jesse away from our teammates because obviously the bounce value is crazy. Yeah, that's pretty good. All right, let's do the same thing now. Uh, let's see what they do. Maybe Jesse goes back to the middle. Okay, Sprout's on me this time, which can be pretty tough. But looks like we've done pretty well. Hmm, I need my hit. I need my hit. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give nice. Okay. Alright. Ugh, I need to go down there. Okay, let's just try and stay alive here. Hmm. Ah, okay. Well, we have a super here. Game's pretty tied up right now. Um... Okay, he's dead. Perfect. Let's just break this. There we go. Nice. Let's try and kill him quickly. Okay. He's gonna go invis. Let's get ready to kill him. Nice. He goes down. Perfect. Okay, well, we wasted our dash, but we should be able to get it back fairly soon. Okay, let's just try and keep the Jesse. Okay, well, he's feeding him quite a lot. I was gonna say, try not to feed him too much. Because, yeah, we should try and push up here. Okay. Nice, we're behind them. Doing pretty well. Alright, he's gonna be one shot here. Sprout is also one shot. Um oh we actually killed a little, never mind. Alright, that's pretty good. Um Crab, you literally could have walked and broken that, but it's okay. Right, how do we get out of this spawn trap then? Hmm, not good, not good. Okay. Well, he has no gadgets left, so as long as we don't feed the sprout, we should be fine. But we are literally feeding everyone else there, which is not good. Okay, he's defending his turret now. Alright. We have completely lost our lead here. Okay, me our super back. Give me my super. Okay, let's get these kills. Nice, he's dead. Alright, we have found our way back here. There we go, crab with a double kill. And now I think we should be able to kill the game here. Okay. Alright, let's just try and stay on the zone. And there we go, we picked up the win. Nice. Alright, well, we got a little bit close, but we managed to get a nice little breakaway on that Sprout. And then once Sprout is down, it's a lot easier. Pick it up, Star Player, as well. Let's see how much ELO we get. Plus 45, not too bad here. Um, hopefully, this last game is a big one, so we get a good amount of ELO, which can hopefully push into the top 10. But yeah, we've broken this 12k ELO, which is very nice. We're now top 11 here. Um, yeah, we need about. We need a big payout, and I don't know if we're going to get that, but we'll see. So let's get straight into the next game. All right, here we are into the final game here. Hopefully ending on a good note right now. So I think the plan is to ban Larry here. Don't want to really play against it. Playing as Bali is fine. I feel like you can counter it a lot easier than Larry. Um, nice ban tip, Lou and Mo. Don't want any of those open, really. Let's see what else we have here. All right, let's see what they ban. They ban Meg, Lily, and Mo. Um, pretty good bans here. Banning out high HP things. So it's going to be loads of control ballers, I'm guessing. Um, control. So like, you know, Stu. You got throwers as well. You got bros like B, Max, Byron. Those type of things here. Gale is open though, which is interesting. This guy goes dynamite first. Okay. Well, the good thing is that if they go Mortis to counter it, we have Gale. And um, so at least we have some sort of reassurance. But... Yeah, absolute psycho behavior going this first. Let's see what this guy has available here. Well, he has Mortis. He has Bro, Leon. There's Surge, but no Hypercharge. There you go. There's a Mortis. Hmm. This guy doesn't have the best Brawlers. I mean, he has Stu. Stu can be pretty decent, but we need to go Gale here, 100%. Um, yeah, just to make sure that our Dynamite is not getting completely wrecked here. Yeah, I'm going Gale, 100%. Um, but at least Dynamite is good into BB, right? So, I think that's pretty good. Gotta go Shelly. Okay, we're definitely going Gale. We need Gale here. They can go, like, Barley or whatever. Or, like, even Stu. And I still think we'll be fine with our matchup here. Okay, so we're gonna have Twister so that the Mortis cannot attack us. I think that's a good strat. And then Stun so that if they push Dynamite, we can just stun him. And just save his life, basically. And just try and focus zone here. We have a good comp for focusing zone because we have wall breaks and stuff. Let's see what they go. Tick. Okay, Tick is interesting. They have Mortis and Tick. That is something you never see, really. That is something you never see. So hopefully we don't get spawn trapped here, but I feel confident. Uh, I do think Tick is quite hard to hit Shelly with, for example. So I think we have a very good comp here. Let's see if we can play it right. 
Um, yeah, I need to really nail down my cycling with my supers. If I waste like one super, it won't be very good. Well, we're playing against a crater here. I don't know who we're playing against. But let's get along with this. Okay. Alright, Pick's gonna just spam the mid probably. Yeah, Pick's in the mid. Spamming his shots. Let's just walk our way up. He already has a tick head. Alright, that's crazy. Alright, well, we go down here. We managed to get 10% before we go down. They're spinning here, whatever. Um, we need some wall breaks. I think wall breaks will be pretty important. There we go. Nice. Okay. Let's just uh, try and deal with this guy. Here we go. Perfect. Nice kills. Okay, there we go. Hopefully, we can start just, you know, getting a good little chain effect. Where is this Morris here? Okay, Morris is going to try and find a way up. Let's get the stun onto him. There we go. All right. We did kind of waste it, but we got most of it back. Hypercharge tickhead coming. Okay, let's just do that. I'm gonna loop back to him. Dynamite go away. Okay, we're fine. All right, we got 50%. Nice. Um, I'm gonna get my hypercharge pretty soon. Moy is just sniping me with his bats, which is an interesting choice. There we go. Nice little super. He's gonna go down pretty much. Nice support from the dynamite. There we go. Okay, we have a hypercharge as well. Okay, well, I don't know why I didn't blow back three times, but there we go. Let's just do that and just try and distract them a little bit. Okay, let's just spam our shots now. There we go. Nice little stun. There we go. Another nice stun. He goes down. We probably go down here by this tick head, but it doesn't matter because we end up the game there. There we go, guys. Gale is so strong. Like, I don't know why they go Mortis and BB. That's kind of reckless of them, but it's ranked, I guess. People go crazy things all the time. Good thing we had Gale here uh, because do we, we ban Lou? I think Lou was banned here. I didn't. I think that's why they went um, this double aggro here. But good thing Gale's open here. If Gale wasn't open, I don't know what I would go. Maybe like a Frank or a Primo. I think Primo would have been pretty good against this. So play one of those. But nice. Okay, good start. Good start. Okay. All right, we go down here as expected. We're always gonna go down. It's, it's kind of similar to playing like Moyes. Like the first interaction, you probably end up dying without getting any value. But once you get your supercharged, it's where the cycling begins. Okay, one, two, three. There we go. I'm gonna pop his gadget. Let's just walk above it. All right. Um, tick in there. Or did tick die? I think tick died. Okay. Why is he doing that? He's very weird. Very very weird. Okay, there we go. Nice hits. And we survived that. And um, yeah, these guys actually have the worst comp I've ever seen in my life. Okay, let's stun that. There we go. Let's take that. There we go. Nice little technique to take out the tick air. Just put your Gale Storm down and just take your time. Um, okay, let's see this guy try and push up against us. We have a hypercharge. Let's just get the stun here. We go another stun and another one and yeah gale is ridiculous against this matchup and that's gonna be a very clean video guys i haven't had this clean of a video for a long time normally i have like one loss in the way which is kind of frustrating sometimes but that was pretty clean seven and three star player obviously against tanks plus 43 elo not too bad here which is so close to breaking into the top 10 but i'll probably play off camera and try and get it if i tilt then that's sad but yeah Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.